pasta. Are you sure India is what you think? Let's check it with me. Welcome to my channel. I am Bata and I would like to show you how India looks like from my perspective. Today, let me take you to the city. If you never have been in India or you don't have any idea about it, I think it will be a good start. If you already have been here, then I think it's nice to remind what you have been through. Let's go by scooter. I feel like I'm only the one woman here who is driving with helmet. That is always troubling me a bit because I have to have hairstyle like that. Keep my hair as much down as possible that the helmet would fit to my head. So that is always some uh, trouble. I will not look perfect. I can't make any special hairstyle and go driving with help. Maybe that's why women don't wear it here. Second thing is I wear some scarf. It is called here Duparta. The scarf is covering us mostly from the dust which is flying everywhere here. Weather is dry, so that might be not so good for your health. I wear it all the time. That is also a good thing because I don't like to be watched by people much. So if I wear it, then people don't see that I'm so much different. I have some work to do outside, so let's go. I just uh, wanted to show you the shops around, uh, but one lady stopped Please me. Please come and, and buy this nail polish here. Just go there. Nail polish, you are not doing nail polish. Go, go there and buy nail polish. Buy nail polish. Go and buy nail polish. And she was very <laughs> not happy that I don't want to buy it. Sometimes it is disturbing. People in places like this will come to you, tell you go to this shop, buy something or some people will come and uh, ask you for money. In beginning I guess it would be interesting but uh, with time it gets a little irritating. So that are the shops here, you can buy almost everything you want. Uh, this is on the way to the supermarket that I want to go. And I want to take you to the supermarket with me because that is pretty interesting what they do. And I want to take you to the supermarket because that is looking a little different than our supermarket. When you enter the supermarket, you can't take with you any big bag, uh, probably to not steal anything. Uh, so in every supermarket it looks a little different. In this one, you just have to keep your um, bag or whatever luggage uh, you have, you have to keep in, the, in place like that. There is no number you get, you just keep it and you have hope nobody is gonna take it. And then you get inside. If you go to supermarket in India, don't take bag or if you have to have something, then ha get some smaller purse where you can keep your phone or wallet or anything important. When you finish your shopping, you do the payment, then in the end, you still not go out of the shop, but someone has to put a stamp on your bill that you took what you bought, you didn't steal anything. I don't know how they are checking it because usually I feel they are just, watch you, they are just watching me for one second and doing the stamp. There is nothing like they check inside your bag what you really have there. In some supermarkets, they will not only put stamp on your bill, but they will also um, check you like on the airport. <laughs> if you don't have any metal thing or if you don't have anything inside um, your cloth that you could steal from the shop. I feel like in India, you can sell your products uh, anywhere <laughs> as here. You don't have to pay any taxes for that. Here we have Train crossing. How the train crossing looks here. I don't know if you recognize, but there is left side and right side. But everybody who seems to go 
on left side are also on right side. And the same is happening on the other side. Uh, so, <laughs> if it uh, gets open, that is getting really uh, a bit messy, but they have a practice, so that's good. If we do it in Poland, everybody would kill each other. You will see when it gets open. There are many classes uh, which you have in trains in India, and they are mostly separated by air conditioning and without air conditioning. And other thing which is differentiating them is uh, some guard which will be there in the train with, uh, with the gun or there are some classes where there is no any guard. And I don't suggest uh, you to go in that. I suggest you go in the air conditioning class. They came, you can see. They are some, uh, selling some things on that. Uh, they come from one place to another, and of course, in India, everything is there on the road. You can adjust. Here, I hope you can see there are people stitching clothes. You can just come, and for very cheap price, they can uh, stitch uh, whatever you need now. There was a line of many, at least like five of them were there. I had to come for a moment to visit someone, so I can show you how an apartment place looks like. I love that small, small places. There is nothing that I can see in the, my place. It feels like sweet. One more difference is the... They always have here metal in the windows, not like we have. We have sometimes on the uh, first floor we will have it to avoid some thieves, but here everywhere. That is not only for the thieves, that, uh, that is also for animals or for example for monkeys to not come inside to your house. Now I need some vegetable shopping. There are many people standing with vegetables, you can choose what vegetable you want. I bought some things, see? Okay, that's all for today. It feels a little dusty. Please let me know in comments if you like today's episode and if you want more videos like that. Subscribe to not miss any episode. Incredible India again with me next week. I hope you will be there. You can find me here also. Bye.